Hey guys, okay, so we're gonna do your math lesson today on this board. Um, we've been doing some, or we've been doing a lot of equations where you had to find the missing piece of the equation. And I'm gonna go back and reteach this skill because it seems like we've had some confusion on it. So I have a math equation up here and I have a sticky note with a question mark. So I want you to look at this equation and I want you to think about what part of this equation do we have to figure out, okay? So we have an eight plus two equals, what part do we have to figure out? Okay, we have to figure out the sum or the total, okay? So when we have an equation, the number that comes after the equal sign is the sum or it's the total number, okay? So we're figuring out this is addition, so we're figuring out, we have to figure out the sum to this problem. So in order to do that, I have to, I have to know what to do with these two numbers. You don't have to turn everything into a huge story problem. We can just use pictures, okay? So I have the number eight, so maybe I'm going to make eight pink circles. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight and the number two so maybe I'm gonna make two triangles okay and we are gonna see if we can figure out this way by counting all of them together if we can figure out the total let's count well actually we don't even need to count all of them because remember pink circles represent the number eight so I can just start with eight I'm gonna put the bigger number in my head eight nine, 10. Do you see how I did that? I counted the bigger number as a whole, as a group, and then I counted on from there, okay? I'm gonna make that a point again. So to make this easier, we're gonna put the bigger number in our heads, and then we're gonna count on from there. We drew eight pink circles. So I don't have to count every single circle because in my mind I know that I drew eight pink circles. So I'm gonna put the bigger number in my head, eight, nine, 10. So let's see if we got that right. We did, okay. So there are a few things. When you do your assignment today, all of your problems are going to look like this and you're gonna to have to you're gonna to have to figure out the total, and then you're gonna to have to match the equation to the matching picture. When you are looking, when you are trying to get to the total amount in addition, I want you to start practicing putting the bigger number in your head and counting on by the smaller number. So between the numbers eight and two, which one's bigger? It's the number eight. So I'm gonna put that in my head. That's why I do this. I'm gonna take the eight, I'm gonna put it in my head. Eight, nine, 10. And then I only counted by two. Do you see how I did that? You take that bigger number, put it in your head, and that's where you start at. Eight, nine, 10. Okay? So that's what you're gonna practice doing for your assignment today. Alrighty? Okay, so I hope I cleared some things up for you. Good luck on your assignment, and I can't wait to see your work.